truly noble, inspired people are interested in a noble and inspiring mission. So if a community ceases to be about its mission, all the people who are about something important are headed for the hills, right? No, uh, there's a thriving community, a community that has life because the people who are leading it are highly inspired themselves. And so they're attracting others who are highly inspired. And then together, there can be a true community, a hierarchy, if you will, but it's most importantly, a constellation of highly dedicated, committed, inspired people who are working together for the sake of what's being done, of what's being served in the mission. If you really care about what the mission is, and you're really being honest about what's happening, there, there is, it's so much easier to have clarity of view as to how we're relating together as others and what the right constellation is for the accomplishment of the mission that we're all dedicated to. Community should be serving the individual, but not at the expense of the mission of the community. We don't have to live in confusion as human beings. When we do, we get adversarial. We get adversarial. Is that not what we do? We feel unsafe. We're either out of integrity as a leader, uh, out, of, out of integrity as someone who's bringing something to focus in the field, or we we're out of integrity as someone who's receiving the direction of, of uh, we'll just call it leadership or hierarchy. And now we, you know, we've got our dukes up, now we're, you know, we're dug in, now we're not feeling safe, and life becomes a battle. Where there's unclarity, no matter how much we're trying to be nice, if we're living a lie, if we're out of integrity, we end up being adversarial. That's no way to live a life. It's no way to be in a family. It's no way to be in a community. Integrity. Integrity of the community around its mission, around its vision of who it is, and around how it's organizing itself to accomplish its mission, mission and to thrive as a community. Those things allow it to live, allow the party to go on, allow it to be a party, and allow it to be loving and wonderful, joyous, creative. There are also people who just don't care. Like there are people who come to Sunrise Ranch and don't care about the mission for the spiritual regeneration of the planet. That's why we're here. That's why I'm here. That's why many of us are here. There are people who don't care about that and come into this context that is for that mission and they're against the hierarchy that is about that mission. But there's actually some of us here who are really, really intent, focused, and dedicated to that mission. <laughs> 